Hey, what's going on guys? Willis here. We're back with another Tower of Fantasy video. I'm going to make this one a quick one for you guys today, but leave a like on this video, leave a comment, subscribe if you're new. In this video, we're going to be showing you how to basically do a little trick where you can infinitely climb without using stamina and also how to cover large areas of land with the jetpack. This is a super handy tip. I feel like everybody needs to know, and this is going to help your traversal of the whole world of Tower of Fantasy a uh, hundred times better, and you're going to enjoy it way more. So um, as well, we are running the giveaway for some polls in Tower of Fantasy. So if you're looking to make some uh, wishes or polls, whatever you want to call it, I keep calling it poll uh, wishes because of Genshin. Um, yeah, go and join my Discord. It'll be linked in the top of the video description. Um, and make sure you're subbed to the channel. That's all you need to do. So, yeah, let's show you guys the first trick. How to infinitely climb any single wall. So, it's very simple. As you can see, we're going to show you what it looks like before. If you were to try and climb this wall. Um, yeah, you pretty much wouldn't wouldn't be able to do it, right? Because you got to you just run out of stamina, right? It's just not enough stamina to climb this entire wall. And you'll just run out. And you'll fall. And you'll die. But here, here's how you do it the, the proper way. Or get yourself on the wall. And as you can see on the right here, there is a jump down button. Mine is on uh, control. And you basically just want to learn how to drop. Learning how to drop is going to help you a ton. So just figure out what your drop button is to drop yourself off the wall. And all you have to do from this point is drop. And then double jump as you're dropping. And then move towards the wall and just reattach yourself. That's all you need. So drop, double jump, and attach yourself to the wall. Drop. Double jump, attach yourself to the wall. Drop, double jump, attach yourself to the wall. You need to be careful you don't dash or anything like I did there. So drop, double jump, drop, double jump, drop, double jump. And you can see you can climb pretty much any wall. As you can see, it, it's a pretty insane trick. Now you need to sometimes reposition yourself. That's fine. But doing this, you can pretty much climb any wall without using any of your stamina if you do it correctly you just got to make sure you're reattaching yourself to the wall and there you go look at that climbing that with stamina would not have been possible but we did it it's a really cool uh, trick you can definitely master and learn and yeah climb any wall in the game if you're determined to now I'm going to be showing you guys the, the jetpack trick where you can essentially glide uh, super far distances. So let's actually do it before this guy attacks us. So obviously you want to be in the air with your jetpack like this. So on the right here, you can see there's a dodge meter. All you need to do is dodge, dodge, and then go back in your jetpack. Wait for it to refill. Wait until he's there and then dodge, 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 and you're back. You need to make sure you do it before it fills up, I'm pretty sure. There you go. And that, look how much look how much distance we traveled by doing that normally. We wouldn't be able to do that. But yeah, if you're trying to cross like a ravine or something, that's going to help you out even more. But I think the most helpful trick, obviously, is the climbing trick I showed you, where you can essentially just climb any wall without using stamina. Look at that. Beautiful little handy movement trick for you guys but yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video uh share this with one friend who struggles to climb cliffs or maybe even glide i don't know and uh, yeah it could help them out hope you guys enjoyed the video be sure to leave a like uh leave a comment if this helped you out and yeah um oh as well for anyone looking to join a crew we are on the olynthius eu server um yep if you want to join the crew is called pity obviously you get benefits like the uh crew store uh, currency stuff which you can buy from the crew store and get all the juicy rewards but yeah i'll see you guys in my next video this has been willis gaming and